Hello Taurus, welcome back to I Enigma. This is Enigma. I'm gonna be doing a general reading. Let's see the messages for you. What's coming in love in your love life? What is going to happen next? Sun Moon Rising or Venus sign in Taurus plus Ross Watchers. If this is a if you want, I mean <laughs> if you want a more accurate personal reading from me, you can reach out to me on WhatsApp, Instagram, or email. Let's see the message for you. Okay, I do also white ray based spells, high is good. We have energized for intention charge, high vibration crystals. Okay, someone that you're dealing with has emotions and feelings for you, texting this person, they're texting you. Okay, but I'm seeing there's also a third party that will interfere between this relationship like a snake. Like there will be a third person that will come to know about your relationship with this person and will interfere between you and your person. There is someone that you guys are talking to. This person admires you, trusts you, and has butterflies in their stomach whenever this person is thinking about you. They have a huge smile. I'm seeing like they, this is someone that has, uh, that sees you as a source of happiness, and you see them as the source of happiness, and both of you are in love or are falling in love with each other. There are emotions, no doubt. But there's a third person interfering. Is this the, the ex of yours? Is this the ex of theirs? Is this someone that you have shared this with there is someone that does not want this connection to work out let me see the third party who is this third party coming between you guys okay okay ace or souls knight of someone is stopping you it could be your ex yeah it could be your ex it could be your past person it could be their past person it's more like the third party is at your side, okay? It's more like that. Because this person is happy texting you, they are crushing over you secretly, but the third party is interfering. There's someone that is definitely, it could be a female, Scorpio, Pisces, Cancer, Libra, Gemini, Aquarius, that's continuously giving you this feeling like, don't trust this person, they're not good, don't trust them. And you might even listen to this person because either this person is someone that is, very close to you or this is your ex lover that just got to know that you are getting involved with someone new so they are trying to come back and get your attention back again so either ways i'm seeing there's a female around there could be an older female as well there could be someone that is married it could be your mother it could be their mother that is coming between you guys someone definitely is causing interference this person has feelings this person has a lot of love but there's an older female married that does not feel that this person is good for you and is coming between you guys or this is happening with them but the connection still gets stronger and stronger with time i'm seeing this person is not listening to anybody you will not listen to anybody you both are going to do what you want to do. And I feel this connection just keeps getting stronger. Okay. This will be definitely working out, I feel. So let me see. This could be someone that is coming between you guys is a Leo or a Cancer or any other sign. Basically, it doesn't matter. But I'm seeing also that um, someone is like drinking. I feel this person drinks. Okay. And they're also trying to get um, confidence if this is a male you're asking about but if you are the man over here then you might be drinking okay to figure out what you're supposed to do the someone is using the uh, confidence through drinking through to get to the decision or some sort of courage like they're trying to find okay there's a possibility if you feel this person is behaving oddly then it's the third party in their life that is interfering. It could be their mother. It could be an older female that's telling them, oh, no, 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 don't go for this. Or it could be an older female in your life that is intoxicating your thoughts about this person. And one of you could stop earlier. One of you could back off. So be careful. Another thing is this. There is a fear of being ghosted because of the past maybe your ex was like that they kept on ghosting you they kept on coming back and you didn't like it and uh, it could have been that your ex was drinking or because they kept on ghosting on you you started drinking so i feel there's also cutting down on alcohol 
cutting down on any kind of addiction some of you have sugar addictions some of you could have the addiction of overthinking about the past experience all of this is getting cut down because this new person that is coming into your life is someone that will build a strong connection with you so much that the one that kept on ghosting you in the past will suddenly disappear out of mind out of sight everything will happen like that you will surrender you will release the old thoughts negative beliefs hard hard feelings yeah some of you had a breakup i feel your person left you for someone else and got married to someone else for some of you it had happened like this so there is a fear that has been um inculcated inside of you making you feel like maybe this new crush maybe this new person will behave the same way you don't trust them this is a new person okay so you have fears let me see about this new person how do they feel about you and what is going to happen next between you and your person things definitely are moving forward they're traveling towards you they're reaching out to you but there is something that needs to end okay this could be a scorpio or a cancer coming towards you or this can also mean one more thing someone that is coming towards you is gonna bring about a major ending in your life and that ending is all about your loss fear of loss the past person leaving your life completely with this person coming into your life there will be such a major transformation in you taurus that you will start taking forward steps towards this person you'll start valuing this person you'll start feeling more strong more powerful because their consistency towards you is going to surprise you and you will be the one then that will start feeling uh, comfort towards them confidence towards them and you will be reaching out to this person i'm seeing you finally walking away from someone because of this new person coming into your life so initially their feelings towards you is like they're coming towards you and then suddenly the tables will turn and you will become more um you know concerned about this person you will start going after this person i feel but something is there there's a transformation happening that is for sure let me just confirm more yes there's a proposal here i'm seeing that they're making a proposal whoever is a man here whoever is a masculine here is going to make a proposal and the death card is accompanying the toxic relationship which means that the toxicity is finally ending so if you have this fear that this connection could be toxic your fear will be released and you will be open to receive or give this proposal to your person of interest so i'm seeing there has been a lot of codependency triggering moments from the past are finally going to end with this person coming into your life so they bring an ending to your life for a new beginning which you feel more powerful more strong more happier more passionate and things will uh, get down to the point of stability and long term relationship so i do see something long term between you and this person that you guys are talking to okay or the one that is coming for you if you're still single completely single yes the death card is also accompanying the forgiving and learning which means that if something has been um hurting you from a long time like a wound it was a wound in your heart and you were not able to heal from it this person is the reason why you will be completely healing from this wound bring yourself back in action and then i'm seeing getting to know each other this new person definitely is someone that you will get to know that you will meet you will you know find very compatible with you would want to settle down with this person only this person you will start loving yourself more than before because this person knows how to keep your heart happy they will open up their heart to you with their honesty with their presence in your life when you need them the most you guys will be honestly discussing with each other your hearts feelings so it's a heart to heart relationship who is this person give me more signs please stars this person is doing something creative or they just love to put a lot of their time and focus on creative work creative hobbies like they could be drawing they could be painting they could be doing some hobby which is connected to their soul soul's journey like this person is very um, soulful like whatever they do it should connect with their soul whatever they do should make their soul very happy so they're creative and they use uh, intuition uh to showcase their talent or this person uses their intuition to showcase um to put to art maybe the artwork whatever artwork maybe the jewelry whatever it is that they do it's like 
something that they have been heavenly guided uh, for so that is what they are that is what they do okay then i'm seeing bad health someone is in bad health i'm seeing someone is definitely in bad health privileged lady okay i feel this person's gonna be if someone at your home is not doing well this person's entry in your life is going to change the whole surroundings going to improve your health if you have been feeling sick lately if you have been feeling tired lately they're coming into your life will make you very happy because they will treat you like you're the king or a queen of their life so i'm seeing also if you have some job related issues this person coming into your life will definitely change your um you know um career situation you may not be taking interest at in your work maybe there's someone that you're taking uh care of or this person could also be someone that has been feeling extremely uh, tired of the responsibilities that they have over their shoulders for their family maybe someone in their family is not good right now or they might not be good or they're just feeling like there's lack of growth or stagnancy but when you come into their life they feel privileged they feel happy things start to move forward so there's something that they do not show they are having in their life and they are working on it they're dealing with it all alone they will value you put you on a pedestal honor you like a king or a queen this person definitely respects you a lot and values you in this relationship so much that you will be surprised okay so if you have been feeling someone left you in the cold someone made you feel like you're not good enough this person is going to reverse the whole situation and honor you like anything you will feel back in the game you'll feel more healthier and happier is what i see and then i'm seeing i wish i could share my good this person wants to share everything about their life with you they want to share their happiness with you because this is someone that is doing good i feel and then i left you before you could leave me there is a chance that this person could leave you if you stay in a confused energy because this person is going to be afraid of rejection i feel this this is the only weakness this person has a, a fear of rejection so the moment they sense that you are not interested or you're not paying equally into this connection any equal efforts into this connection they might leave before they hear this from you before they hear a no from you they could leave before that so i feel things need to move or push forward fast okay what are they going to offer what is that they will offer prepare to be shocked prepare to be astounded okay they're gonna come with a big surprise yeah what is that please give me clarity on that Mm -hmm. yeah i'm seeing they're gonna give you a big expensive gift or they're gonna put a ring on you you guys may get engaged as well or you guys will talk about marriage a lot this person is very interested in getting committed to you ten of cups they see you as their life they see you as their happiness they see you as their world they see you as they will see you as the one that they want to have kids with they will intuitively guess you are the one and they will know that you're the one that they want to be with ten of cups ace of pentacles is something big so they're coming with a new beginning to end this journey of searching okay i feel you guys will definitely be very happy because this person is attractive they look good they are amazing they are happy person i feel this person is a happy person because we got all three happy cards this person is happy so they're going to change your life and raise the vibrations that you're meant to have okay and feel really good about yourself so the ten of cups is more like complete happiness wish fulfillment family wishes coming true getting married being in a relationship and still life is so adventurous with this person because i see the wand energy which is more of an adventurous energy adventurous person this person is full of fire passion burning desire ventures and you know um they also have strong hates and liking over things and this is also someone very selective so they chose you or you will choose this person you'll be shocked that this person has chosen you to be the one for them let me see the message from the universe over here the message is 
wow someone is going to reveal their deep feelings for you so be excited be excited to either reveal or to hear this person's uh declaration of love for you they're going to commit to you they'll tell you how much they feel for you how much they love you they want a commitment they want they want a person that is fair with them that is compatible with them so i'm seeing an engagement a love offer both of you are agreeing to this connection it's like a wish come true everything is happening in alignment so if you have been in crossroads lately i'm seeing you will be in one direction let us see some hints about this person who is this person okay this could be a pisces sun moon rising or venus or scorpio pisces cancer they love nature they love all things that is natural real they have a very good character this person is honest they could have r and e in their name s in their name a in shreya yeah in their name okay so t this person is a t lover or this person is talking about t or or stuff like that could be tall uh ria could also be the name tania i'm seeing very indian names right now and teen uh neat this person is neat and clean like they're honest i don't think this person drinks no i don't think this person has drinking habits at all uh sean could be the name reason i'm also seeing reason they really need a reason why you behave such a way i feel for some of you need a reason from this person they will give you resentment i'm also seeing someone has a resentment from the past that will go away with this person coming into your life essential this person will become an essential part of your life in the near future because they bring in a lot for you a lot of presents a lot of happiness and gifts someone is tensed here i feel it could be you that is tensed about how things are going to move forward you really tend stop taking tarot readings about these things just go ahead with the flow and enjoy life that's it the 10 is also again telling me there are a lot of 10s which means that you're moving to the point of a new beginning with ace and ending it to a completion so you're reaching your point of completion you or your person has these letters in your in your names okay natalie someone's from sweden santorini anywhere anywhere guys it could be um racial someone's name is anastasia Someone is a clear sentient here who reads energies. So yeah, I'm seeing Taurus energy very highlighted over here. You are going to rule. Someone's name is Albert. Someone's from Argentina. Anywhere. Yeah. Any adjoining messages, please? okay we have claw avoid any kind of risk when it comes to your money i'm seeing a lot of money coming in this is the period of excitement something new something excitement there's an announcement coming in avoid telling your secrets because someone might gossip about you and may create a fuzz about it fun about it yes pay attention to your work you might be uh not focusing on your work right now and yes someone can put some blame on you so you may need to defend yourself beware of being too proud of yourself just be grounded just be humble and nice and down to earth yes you have great new big opportunity coming into your life you might be dealing with a man if you're watching this you're a female then you're dealing with a man and vice versa you are going to be the major person in their life yes your difficulties are about to end everything is ended that has kind of like affected you in the past i'm also seeing that someone that is gossiping there's a man that is gossiping behind your back don't listen to this person i'm also seeing this could be someone born in january or something that happened in the january is finally ending you have a relationship a beautiful relationship coming into your life romance is in the air but you have to pay attention to uh not hide anything or to um ignore the red flags okay because hidden secrets can be possible that later you might find some secret about this person 
increase your efforts if you want to reach your goals and then yeah i'm seeing you being more goal oriented from now onwards i'm seeing you're changing you're becoming more focused yeah there's someone that is criticizing you for the right thing so listen to the criticism don't avoid financial gain with something that you did in the past is about to happen you're going to be victorious in whatever venture you're going into now yeah there's someone that is not willing to change like they're being too aggressive it could be your father as well so don't argue with that person yeah it could be you that is not feeling really healthy right now maybe you are too worried about something maybe there's health issue maybe you are too anxious so take care with this person coming in your health will also improve yes yeah, so there's someone new that you will be meeting a complete stranger i feel you will develop the deep friendship with this person you guys will feel like best friends pay attention to your money okay because you're not paying attention to your work october is a period that you will see extreme shocking luck you might get married or you might get engaged or you may start some new venture at work so that's about it i hope you enjoyed this wonderful read taurus thank you for your time please do like share comment and subscribe i'll see you back again with more stuff bye